What is up everyone and welcome back to a brand new series of reactions on the channel. As you guys know, I am currently in Japan while you are watching this. Now I have been trying to get videos backlogged for when I am in Japan so that you guys don't need to worry about content and things like that. And I decided that I wanted to watch Sword Art Online. I have heard so much about this. I know the first season is short so I thought it's something that I could start and have finished by the time I even return from Japan. So with that being said, there's still gonna be some Naruto on the channel. It honestly just depends how far in advance I got and yeah, I have no idea at this moment in time how many episodes are gonna be there. So in regards to this, I know nothing about it. It's gonna be the same though, it's gonna be transparent, it's gonna be edited and the full unedited versions will still be up on my Patreon if you want to go check those out, totally fine. And with that, let's go ahead and watch episode one. Also, don't forget if you do enjoy these reactions to hit that subscribe button on my channel and also check out my Instagram. Let's do this. Hi there, time for this week's MMO stream. You just saw a promo of today's featured game and this is what last week's launch day looked like. Can you guess what everyone's waiting in line for? So this is like futuristic and to do with gaming, right? I don't really know much about any of this. I'm kind of going into this ridiculously blind. Oh, paper cut. Ouch. It's actually really weird watching an anime that is so clear. I'm so used to Naruto being like weird dimensions and you can barely see anything. Oh. So they plug themselves in. Link start. Oh. Okay, so it's like that Bruce Willis movie. <laughs> Welcome to Sword Art Online. Where's the cheesy intro? There's no cheesy intro. I'm gonna have to get used to all these new characters. Hello world, I'm back. So is he our main character? God, it's really beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna enjoy this. Um, so it's his deal. Why don't we form a party? Well, I don't know, maybe. Oh, come on. <laughs> It'll be great. Could you imagine if this was real life, though? It'd be so cool. You act like you know your way around here. You were in the beta test, weren't you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> cool. Today's my first day. So, could you give me some tips on the lower floors? Yeah, I don't know if... Oh, please, I'm begging you. Look, my name's Klein. Good to meet you. Uh, all right, I'm Kirito. Kirito? Oh! Damn! That looked painful. Can't feel any pain. Hmm. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Sorry, habit. Remember what I said? The first move is the most important. Yeah, that's easy for you to say. But he won't stand still. But he's shaking his butt. If you do your initial motion right and activate a sword skill at the right time. Oh no! Are you gonna make him mad? Initial motion? Here's an easier way to look at it. Right after you start your move, wait for a little bit. When you feel the skills start to activate, drive it home. Drive it home? <laughs> He's kind of derpy. So is there actual games based off of this anime? Or was it a game first? And then they made it an anime. Like, what was first? Chicken or the egg? <gasps> he killed him! So it's like being in an RPG. That would be my life. Congratulations. 
But that boar's about as weak as slimes in other games are. Holy crap, you gotta be kidding! Slimes? Like Dragon like Quest? Like yeah, as if. Whoa! Addictive, isn't it? I'll say. So these skills, there's a ton of them, like blacksmithing and stuff, right? Uh-huh. I heard the game has an unlimited number of them. All except for magic, though. An RPG without magic? That's a bold decision, man! That's a weird decision. So, what do you think? It's kind of fun to move your body as you fight, isn't it? <laughs> oh, hells yeah! You ready to move on? Yeah, man. Let's keep going. I suppose the the real world in comparison would be so lame when compared to around, this. I can't believe it. I just want to know if you could live in game, any whoa. RPG, what would you live in? I'd genius. probably live in Final Fantasy VIII. This thing's amazing. Makes me glad I was born when I was, you know? It's not that big a deal. Cut me some slack. It's my first full dive. As soon as I got the money together, I rushed out and bought all the hardware to play SAO. Stood in line and scored one of the 10,000 hard copies. Mm -hmm. Guess you could say I was pretty lucky. Although, you, sir, were 10 times as lucky getting to beta tested. Hmm? Dude, only a thousand people got the chance. Mind if I ask how far you got in the beta? Uh, two months and I couldn't get further than floor eight. Hmm? But now I think I can get there within a month. Easy. Sounds to me like you're really into this. Yeah, you could say that. During the beta test, SAO was the only thing on my mind, day and night. In this world, a single blade can take you anywhere you want to go. You want to go do some more hunting? Well, you know it. But the thing is... He's hungry. I'm really hungry. I have to log out. Too bad the food you eat here only satisfies your hunger virtually. Yeah, for reals. That's why I ordered a pizza for 5.30. Wow, <gasps> you're so prepared. You know it. Besides, the game can wait until I get my pizza on. I guess. Is he kind of addicted to it? You know, if you want, you can friend him and hang with us. Uh, no, it's cool if you don't want to. No pressure. I can always introduce you to him another time or something. Yeah, sorry. Oh, he's a bit of a loner, huh? Thanks for everything, man. Really. Guess I'll see you around then. If there's anything else you want to know, message me. Huh, sweet. I'll do that. I really like the concept of this. I feel like it's the not too distant future. Or where'd the logout button go? <gasps> it should be there. Hmm. Nope, it's not there. It should be at the bottom of the main menu. Excuse me? <gasps> See, not there. <gasps> it's not. Oh well, today's what? The first day out of beta? It's bound to be some bugs. I bet the server people are freaking out right now. You will too. Huh? Look, it's 525. It's pizza! Oh my god, my teriyaki mayo pizza and ginger ale! Why don't you just contact the game master? Huh? Yeah, I did that, but nothing's happening. He's not oh picking up. Oh my god! Do you know if there's another way to log out of this thing? Whenever a player wants to log out of SAO, the only way they can do it is by going through the menu. That can't be right. What? There's gotta be some other way out. Return. Log out. Escape. Oh my god, but people could starve to death. Told you so. And there was no emergency log out in the manual either. I'll just rip the nerve gear off my head. Don't bother. Once you're hooked in, you can't move your body in the real world anymore. The nerve gear intercepts all the commands you give from inside the game using an interface built into the rig. What? Seriously. Then why would you so do now this? now we gotta wait until someone gets around to fixing the bug? That. Or until someone in the real world comes along and takes the nerve gear off us. That's it. Well, I live alone. <gasps> you? I got a mom and a sister. And I'm pretty sure they'll notice by dinner time and come over. <laughs> you, you got a sister? How old she? What's she like? Oh my god. Irrelevant right now? You wouldn't date a gamer if he's the last Who cares? I wanna- <laughs> Calm yourself down, you pervert! All right, getting kicked in the balls doesn't hurt. Get serious. Don't you think this is weird? Yeah, totally. But it's just a bug. This isn't just a bug. If we can't log out, 
it's gonna cause some serious problems for the game. Yeah, I guess you're right. Like what? What kind of problems? I wonder if the developers even know what's happening. Because they could just shut down the server and log everyone out. But why haven't they made an announcement? Oh man, this is, this is good. This is intense. The thing I picked up on the most was he said that they need to eat, you know? And if they don't get them out soon, they're gonna starve. They'll starve to death. Is that everyone gone back to the hub or something? Like the home Do hub? You know what's going on? Uh uh. Someone forced to teleport. What? <gasps> what is this? This is cool. Look, up there. Have they been hacked? Now what? What? <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> what the hell is that thing? I don't know. It's creepy. Is that the game master? Why doesn't he have a face? Is this an event? I'm scared. Don't worry. It's just part of the opening ceremony. Are you sure? Attention players, my name is Akihiko Kayaba, and as of this moment, I am in control of this world. Seriously? Is that really you? Wow, that's some entrance. I'm sure most of you have already noticed an item missing from your main menus, the logout button. Let me assure you, this is not a defect in the game. I repeat, this is not a defect. This is how Sword Art Online was designed to be. What? You cannot log yourselves out of SAO. And no one from the outside will be able to shut down or remove the nerve gear from your head. What? If anyone attempts to do so, a transmitter inside the nerve gear will discharge a microwave signal into your skull, destroying your brain and ending your life. What? Yeah. He's gotta be nuts, right? Right, Kirito? He's not. The transmitter signals in the headgear work just like microwaves. If the safety's disabled, it could fry your brain. <gasps> Couldn't someone cut the power or...? That won't work. The nerve gear's got an internal battery. <sighs> this is crazy! It's totally crazy! Despite my warning, the families and friends of some of the players have attempted removing the nerve gear. An unfortunate decision, to say the least. As a result, the game now has 213 less players than when it began. Oh my god! They've been deleted from both Einkrad and the real world. 213? No way. At this point, it's safe to assume the likelihood of a nerve gear being removed is minimal at best. <laughs> I hope this brings you a little comfort as you try to clear the game. So you have to clear the game to get out? There is no longer any way to revive someone within the game. If your HP drops to zero, your avatar will be deleted from the system forever. <laughs> and the nerve gear will simultaneously destroy your brain. This is nuts! I can't believe this. There's this only is one mental. Way for a player to escape now. You must clear the game. Right now, you're gathered on floor one, the lowest level of Einkrad. If you can get through the dungeon and defeat the boss, you may advance to the next floor. Defeat the boss on floor 100, and you will clear the game. 100? Even the beta testers never made it that high. Last but not least, I've placed a little present in the item storage of every player. Please, have a look. A mirror? <gasps> oh my god, oh no! <laughs> oh wait, oh okay. I thought they were like dying or something. It puts you back to the okay, start. Kirito? Yeah. Wait, who are you? I'm me, who are you? <gasps> eh? It changes their appearance. Wait a second. Is, Is that, that you, Kirito? Kirito? Uh, but how? The scan. 
There's a high-density signal device inside the nerve gear rig. It can see what my face looks like. But how's it know my height and body type? Oh! When you so people are legit on, now! You do this calibration thing. It asks you to touch your body all over like this. Remember? Oh yeah, you're right. That's where it got our physical data. Right, right now, now, you're, you're probably, probably wondering why. Why would Akihiko Kayaba, developer of Sword Art Online and Nerve Gear, do this? Ultimately, my goal was a simple one. The reason I created Sword Art Online was to control the fate of a world of my design. Kayaba. As you can see, I have achieved my goal. This is not what I expected when I put this on today. And the official launch of Sword Art Online. Players, I wish you the best of luck. Oh, they're all gonna die! What the hell? Well, at least everyone looks like how they should. And they're gonna panic. Everyone is about to panic. It's not a game. It's real. Akihiko Kayaba created a virtual world. He designed the Nerve Gear rig. The man's a genius. I've been a fan of his for a long time. So I know. Everything you just said is the truth. If I die in the game, I'll die in real life. And it's hit everyone! Let me out! Let me out of here! I can't stay here! I have a meeting I after this! Anything. Stop pushing! You have to let us go! Wait, seriously? What did we ever do to you? We just want to play a game! Come back! <laughs> Come on, Colleen. <laughs> Listen, I'm heading out right now for the next village. I want you to come. The only way we're gonna survive in here is by making ourselves as strong as possible. Look, the fields around the town of Beginnings are gonna be hunted clean soon. If we head to the next village now, we'll have an easier time collecting cash and points. Don't worry, I know all the paths and places we should avoid. Even if I'm level one, I can get there easy. You know those friends of mine I was telling you about? We stood in line for a whole night to buy this and... Are they in there? At the plaza somewhere. And I can't leave them. Oh, I'd probably go back for my friends too. Sorry. Can't ask a guy I just met to risk his life for a bunch of strangers, can I? So don't worry about me. Get your ass to the next village. I'll be fine. The last game I played, I ran a guild, so I'm more than prepared. And with all the stuff you taught me, I'll get by, no sweat. Be seeing you, Klein. Take care. Kirito! I... Hey! Kirito. Uh... You look better like this. Aww! Way cooler than your avatar. <laughs> yeah, and I think that scruffy face fits you ten times better, too. That was adorable! That's a shame. I feel like he needs to be around more people. So, oh my god, they have to go a hundred levels. So what's that, a hundred bosses? In order to survive? This is amazing! Is that a cat? Is that a black cat? I got this! I can do this! No, it's a wolf, okay. This world can't beat me! I will survive! Oh, this is so good! I love it! Oh, nice! Oh, I am so happy that I decided to watch this. I'm guessing that is the end of episode one. All right, so that was the first episode of Sword Art Online. Uh, that little twist where it's like, wait, we can't log out? It's like... What? Can you imagine being in that position? That would be absolutely petrifying. <gasps> no, that is terrifying. This is so good. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. As I say, the full reaction will be over on Patreon. And I'll see you tomorrow for episode two. Bye, guys. Bye.